Hi, I'm Jacob Hornberger, President of the Future of Freedom Foundation. Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump are at each other's throats over which one is fit to be president. It never occurs to either one of them that neither one of them is fit to be president. But in any event, Clinton's calling on President Obama to let in 10,000 of those uh, European refugees. I guess she's trying to portray herself as the great lover of the poor, needy, and disadvantaged. You know, never mind that it's her interventionist policies in Libya, Iraq, Syria, all over the Middle East that have given rise, that have caused this massive refugee crisis. Uh, but notice, how does she arrive at the number 10,000? See, that's the mind of the central planner. It never occurs to her that the reason we have had in this country an ongoing immigration crisis for 60 to 70 years is because of socialism in the form of immigration central planning. The bureaucrat maintaining what Hayek called the fatal conceit that he knows what the right number is, the right proportion, the right qualifications, and so forth. How did Trump respond to this? He says, don't let in any refugees. Let's have a government jobs program for the poor here in America. <laughs> what? I mean, he's a Republican. He's supposed to be talking free enterprise, free markets. Instead, he's got his own socialist program. And this is what Republicans have been doing for decades. They battle socialism with their own plans for socialism. What are the, what's Trump going to have those poor people doing? Uh, digging ditches and filling them back in? Notice that neither one of them ever talks about free enterprise, free markets. That's the key to prosperity, to harmony, to peace. Stop the government from managing the economy. Stop the government from helping the poor. And let freedom reign in terms of economic liberty and free markets.